Welcome to the first episode of Robert Tried, a series created by your favorite Rec Sports programs, communication interns, Doyer and Robert. I'm Robert Lewis, and I plan to try each of our fun club sports here at UF. Today's episode, Bader Judo Jam. Are you scared of Robert? Yes. Wow. What makes you say that? The thought of dying. What? Say you're scared of robbery? No, Robert. That's my name. Oh. Are you scared of Robert? He, th he thought you said robbery. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I feel like most people are in fact scared of Robert. I'm a little scared of Robert. Yeah. Re. Oh. Robbery. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's yeah, what yeah. No, I okay, just want to make bad. sure. Yeah, okay. Are you scared of Robert? Not quite. <laughs> so, thank you for having me. Would you say that the Gator Judo Jam was a success? Yes, for sure. We put a lot of effort into it. Um, we had a lot of different uh, meetings with people. Um, and we're really grateful to the College of Health and Human Performance also for giving us a space and helping to promote our event. Do you think Robert self-defended himself? Yeah, he did. Successful self-defense. someone stronger than you by pushing at them the same way they're pushing back at you. You take their force and pretty much use that to throw them or to do whatever. So if I'm pushing then, or if he's pushing, then I'm going to pull. And that's the principle of Jew essentially. So don't go head on, but kind of use their force to move them. If you could... So what you'll notice what's happening now is our judoka are rolling and protecting themselves as they're doing these rolls. These are called Ukemi rolls, and they're actually pretty real life uh, relevant. Uh, my dad has been doing judo for several decades. He fell off the roof and he did a Ukemi roll, and he was completely fine. He didn't need wrist surgery because we're landing on the wrist, but you know, two stories, and you think he might not survive. The thought of dying. Ryan and I had evaded death thus far, and we're learning some self defense techniques along the way. But I wanted to know just how interested Ryan was in the club. So, are, would you say that this event has made you interested in joining the judo club? Yep. Yes, right here. I mean, I've been doing judo for about two years. I started off my freshman year. Um, through that, I, I had no martial arts experience before I came in, but it was through just going to practice, and um, I was learned a lot about just throws. And honestly, it's pretty cool. All the things that we get to do. Was your first experience with it here at the Gator Judo? Yes, exactly. So I had no experience, kind of just showed up my first time and then really found a community yeah. here. And it's been great ever since. No, this is really where I found my community and the people here all, are all great. I mean, you have to get to know each other pretty well if you're just slamming each other on the ground. <laughs> so. That makes sense. <laughs> awesome. All right, well, thank you so thank much. Thank you I so really much, Robert. Thank you. And slam each other on the ground we did. But one question remained. <laughs> Ryan, would you say Robert tried? Yes, I did. I so, so what would you say? Would you please look at the camera and say Robert tried? Robert tried. <laughs> 